Okay, YouTube, a little something different for you. Today we're going to be doing a timing chain on this 2.2 Ecotech engine. It's an 09 Cobalt. And if you can hear that ticking under here, the sound of the timing chain. Uh, actually, the tensioner is what goes bad and it causes the timing chain to loosen up and, and you get a uh, timing chain slap. It's in there slapping. Now, this is an interference engine. What that means, for those of you that don't know, is if this timing chain breaks, you're going to bend every fucking valve in this engine. Then you're looking at major money. So it's best to spend, what do we spend, like 168 bucks on the parts? We'll say 200, whatever. I had to buy a couple of tools, but. Um, it's best to do that than spend 3000 later, you know what I mean? So we'll be periodically here uh, showing you what we're going to be doing. So first, Sean, will you shut that off for me, please? Thank you. Um, first, we're going to take all this plastic stuff off. But the first thing you must do in order to do this, now, this is very important, do not forget. You must have one of these. Actually, you must have several because this is a pain in the ass to do. All right, so that's the first step is crack open a beer and stand here and look at it and go, damn, this sucks. Okay, we'll be back with you in a little bit, you two. What you should find after you take all the plastic off and the air breather, this is what's going to come off right here, this stuff, and then you're going to get started. So what? What's going to have to happen is this front motor mouth going to have to come off. That belt's going to have to come off right down here. All this stuff's going to have, this will have to come off. So all these spark plugs and everything's going to have to come out. This fuel rail will move out of the way. And this top cover will come off. And then we'll take the front cover off, which is down here, down in there. And that's how we get to the, and we'll have to take this piece of plastic covering off right here so we can get to the harmonic balance or the bottom fluid. So there's what you should be looking at right now. To take that off, we used a 10 millimeter socket, deep well for the air box, which was for these. And this, which is a little plastic clip that goes in here, that holds that top cover on, which looks like, should look like this. You can see that. So there we go, we're gonna start tearing this down. You recording? Mm-hmm. Okay. Can you get this right down in here? YouTube, this is back at off a little bit. Will you the please the uh make a zoom out? Got it? Because mm -hmm. it starts in a certain at a certain zoom, I don't know why. But anyway, hey YouTube. Uh Pooh Bear's recording this for me because hands are dirty. Are you getting that baby? Now this is what it looks like when you have your your uh cam cover off which uh, it's also known as a valve cover but see there's but uh, this is what it looks like now right down in here can you get this baby mm -hmm. can you see it okay this is what I was talking about I don't zoom out thank you all right sorry about the pause but uh battery one day I had to change the battery pack and camera but anyway uh, I was saying what the hell was I saying valve cover but down in here this chain kind of bring the camera down see if they can hear this as soon as this truck goes by. But this right here, can you see it, honey? Mm -hmm. I don't know if you can see that real well, but that's loose. And that's what your timing chain slapping is in there making that funny noise. Now, as I said, if, if this breaks, the valve timing is going to be off. So them valves are going to be open when they should be closed and the piston is going to come up and tap them and bend them. But, um, this is what we're replacing. We still got to pull the front of the engine off here so we can get to everything we need to do in there. Now, but that's the noise you will hear right there. And uh, for those of you that have these Ecotech engines, it is recommended to change the timing chain assembly around 75,000 miles. Now in this case, we're like at 105,000 never done anything to this car and by the way the transmission you cannot check the transmission fluid on this certain model here this this engine and transmission you cannot check the transmission fluid or add it just by dumping the cord in so every 30,000 miles you should have it serviced or serve it yourself service it yourself if you if you can do that 
but I highly recommend that doing it at uh, every 30,000 because like I said this has got 105,000 on it she bought the car when it had zero miles and uh, how many times has your transmission been serviced baby maybe once maybe once and we're not sure so I'm gonna say zero but anyway it's a little over <laughs> But she's with me now, we'll get it taken care of. So we're gonna take some of this stuff off here. Here's your, your front motor mount. I know it's on the side, but it's called the front because this is the front of the engine. There it goes this way, one, two, three, four. Now, I've marked the uh, coil packs. There's four coil packs, I've marked them. Now, they're pretty much only one way they'll go in, but, you know, I just do it for peace of mind because I don't want to fuck anything up. But anyway, we'll get back with the YouTube and uh, I'm going to have one of these and a little smoke. By the way, we don't own the rights to the song playing in the background. I don't own the rights to this, Miller High Life or Chevy. But hey, we don't care. Sue me. All right, Shea Bear, we'll talk to you in a few. All right, YouTube, we're back. We got the front cover off this thing. 09 Cobalt, Cobalt 2.2. Now, I'll go down under this way and videotape up for you. Now, get a kind of a, I don't know if you can see that. See it, chain? And you heard this car running. I cannot believe this. That's the timing chain. Now up here, watch this. I can pretty much take that off with my hands. That chain right there. That's all it takes to cost a, an engine problem. Right there, it just jumped time. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, right there, it just jumped time. That's freaking amazing. Wow. Yeah, I just went like that. Look, just jumped time. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That's all it took. Probably if we'd have started again. Honest to God. I know it's not like a doctor. You will die if you don't do this. If we'd have started that again, I'm guessing. I'm guessing we would have blew it up. But. Alright. Well, there's that. And we're going to have one of them. And I'm going to have a smoke. And I'll pull that chain off there and get the new one in there. Alright, we'll be back at you in a few. Alright. Okay, now here's. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> Hi, Poo. Hello. Okay. What did we? What did we just do? We put in a timing chain. Right. What kind of engine? It's a 2.2 Echo engine. Okay, Ecotech. Very e good. Ecotech. Awesome. Now wait a minute. Now this is what it looks like when it's all done. Everything I showed you guys, it's not hard. The hardest part is make sure. Please make sure you get the timing marks right. But uh, other than that, you just, you know, just reverse the process. Make sure you put every bolt back in, um, you know, and everything should be fine. So this is the first startup on this car. And uh, we'll go out here. Are you ready, Pooh? I'm ready, babe. This is, this is your baby car. Yeah. All right, give it a shot. Let's see what happens. There we go. And if you do it right, that's the way this thing should start, and it'll start like that every time. Well, YouTube, you know, um, go ahead and kill it, baby. Um, we we have a lot of fun making these videos. Just thought we'd want to, just thought we'd do something a little different for y'all. And uh, you know. <sighs> Shout out to everybody, Ben, Moo, Ben and Steve, hey, you guys are great, keep videos rolling, we'll do the same thing on our end, uh, all of our subscribers, you know, I don't have time to list them, but, uh, you know, you're all good, we appreciate everything, oh, Extra God, parts, oh, my God, we forgot to put that in, that chain will fly off, <gasps> shut up, anyway, that's the old one, but, <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Anyway, Pooh Bear, are we gone? We're gone. We're gone. We're going to drink a Miller beer, smoke a cigarette, and don't run the race to that. But, uh, you know, when you've had a hard day, crack open a Miller. Have some fun, baby. Uh, offer void. We're prohibited by law. All right. We're out of here.